and it's Transformation Tuesday. Now you're looking at a picture of Ann Cordial, a local real estate agent who's frustrated at not being able to lose weight no matter what she tried. She reached out to Charles D'Angelo, weight loss coach, and just a few months later, she dropped 30 pounds. You are looking at her right now live in the Show Me Studio, and you look amazing. Please have a seat. Tell us, you know, what made you finally make the decision to call Charles? I have bone on bone in my knees, and mm. I had gone to the doctor, and mm. while I was in the examining room, he had a sign that said, for every extra pound you have on you, it's three extra pounds of load on your knees. Mm. And mm. I thought, I need to do it now. Nothing else was working. Yes. So you mentioned nothing else was working. What was it about Charles' program that really helped you kind of get back on track with what you were wanting, your goals? Well, I, I was accountable to him every mm -hmm. two weeks when I would see him, and he made it so simple. Mm -hmm. Every meal was, I'm told what to do. It was outlined. I, I'd take a, <laughs> um, a, thing, a bag with me to work every day and have yeah. all my food and didn't have the urge to go out to eat or anything. It was great. It was simple, which, yes. is, which is big. Yes. Simple and approachable. Yes. So what has been the most positive change that you've seen since working with Charles? Well, my knees are a lot better. Oh, good. Yes, and so I can walk seven, eight miles a day, and it's not a problem. It's great. That's I love remarkable. To walk. How many sizes have you dropped? Yeah. Um, from I was going into a twelve, and now I'm a four. Wow. <laughs> I mean, that is remarkable. Oh, yeah. And even just mentioning that your knees and being able to walk—that's such a big part of of life. That joy of life, being yes. able to just enjoy yes. the present moment, go for a walk, and not feel that pain. Absolutely. So, Charles, you know, what can someone do today to change their life? Well, the first thing I think is really define for yourself what you want. Okay. So many people feel lost, and that's a really big problem when you don't have orientation about what direction you want to go in. So, if you don't know what direction you want to go in, ask yourself what you don't want to have happen. Uh, sometimes painting a real high resolution image of just how out of control our life can become mm -hmm. if we continue to drift. Sometimes we keep ourselves so busily distracted we don't think about the consequences of our behaviors. Mm -hmm. No matter what's happened to you, you know, maybe you went through a very traumatic childhood. I was 360 pounds as a kid, mm -hmm. you know, so my whole journey is what started me on the path of serving other people. Mm -hmm. I had every reason to be the king of excuses. But if you look at what you're actually doing and see how far off that can take you to a place that's really hellish, it's really horrific, mm. it's really painful, and, and you use that kind of as something to move away from. And then on the other hand, you look at how awesome your life can be when you have a really high resolution set of goals, things that are mm -hmm. exciting, things that are compelling. Uh, for Anne, she loves being active. Yeah. I mean, talk about some of the things that you do that now are much easier because of your weight loss. Well, the walking, of course, yes. and playing pickleball. Pickleball! And, pickleball. <laughs> yeah. and working out with my trainer. Mm. I had them up everything, yeah. so that's much better. So I, I really concentrate a lot on myself now, mm -hmm. where I was all work before. Now I mm -hmm. still work a lot, but I'm trying to spend more time on me. Yeah, so so to answer your question, it's really having well-defined goals, knowing yeah. what you're after, knowing the reasons that you're after those things. Mm -hmm. And then the missing aspect for a lot of people is they don't know what the heck to do. Yeah. This program says do this, this program says if you do that, it won't work. So having someone in your life, a coach to streamline things to tell you exactly what to eat, when to eat, how much to eat, what to do with exercise, so there's no guessing. When a person comes to see me, you leave every single session with a very precise action plan of here's exactly what to do, mm -hmm. and then we address what's coming up in the coming weeks. So if yeah. you're gonna travel, this summer, everyone has vacation. Yes. And often people say to themselves, well, I'll wait until after summer to start. Well, you can yeah. always find an excuse not to begin. The yes. best time to start was yesterday. Yeah. The second best time is right now. Right now, absolutely. <laughs> and I love how you're mentioning intent. It's so important. And so for Anne, kind of, we have about 30 seconds here, but what would you say if someone was on the fence about reaching out to Charles? Just do it. Yeah. Just do it. It's the best thing I did. I yes. love that. Use this moment right, right now. now. Yeah. And it's it's just even just to enjoy life. Pickleball. I love pickleball. <laughs> pickleball, walking, running, all of the things. Thank you, Anne, for joining us today thank and sharing you. your story. And Charles, thank you as always for inspiring us on this Transformation Tuesday. You can reach out to Charles with all of that information right there on your screen. And have a great rest of your day. See you tomorrow.